So, apparently Lockheed and Martin Wright and, and Betty Zim are going to Netflix. Yep. There we go. Hey, give me a tip, bro. Right? Yeah, I'm going to go Betty Zim, Lockheed and Martin Wright, but they're heading to Netflix. Yep. Now, what do you want to talk about it? Everyone, I do want to, uh, I'm a kid for the 90. Well, if you don't know that, um, I actually grew up with both these shows. And the reason you're not both these specials are going to Netflix, that does actually sound very intriguing. And since they involve two of my favorite shows, making it a sort of comeback, sort of. Can't have a long story. Right, I'm gonna put my head in the ring. Yep. So, enjoy the on the ancient, ancient news. See ya. Oh, I know. As you can tell my intro, I think it's already into about this news. Why? You'll find out. Let's get started. According to all the other viewers on CPR.com, and I quote, <gasps> Invader, Zim, Rockwood, Monterey, Spessard, heading to Netflix. Yep. Two specials based on fan favorite Nickelodeon, car- Nickelodeon cartoons, Invader Zim and Rockwood Monterey, will finally see the live day on Netflix. Yep. A Nickelodeon fan sign, Nickelive, Weird, weird name. Um, notes. Bob Baker, and Bobby Kane President and Chief Executive Officer revealed that Rocket Martin Wright, Star Queen, and Vader Zim entered the Forpus will be premiering on Netflix in a recent earnings call with investors. Yep. And here's the kicker. Although they were both announced in 2016 and 2017, respectively, eh, both films went through delays that saw the show respect creators, Rocket, Joe Murray, and Zim. Johan Vasquez, we name, um, publicly questioned when the fan would ever be, would ever be released. Yep. While it's unclear when the movie will debut, Stan Queen, which is directed by Murray, will reportedly see Rockwood's signature brand of sub visible satire on the digital age. Yep. Well, into the floor of it, we'll see what happens when Zen's Supreme Sub Company is shattered. Yep. And apparently, uh, uh, uh both of them will, will, will and on the cable channel itself. They were penny free on Netflix. Yep. Also, um penny we have two reboots in the world. One World Wars Revival, a TV film, and Hey on it. Yep. And that's the time about the TV TV Ninja Turtles we will be on soon John as well, which I don't care about the Yeah, that's the end all gonna show. Hey oh I'm gonna show Rocket Mountain Night and the Bay Zero go ahead to Netflix. My, my, my thought there as a whole, I do want to know he fans about both the show. I grew up with both the shows. And how of shows come back, finally, after years and years, years away. And that's exciting to hell. And while well, I am by now, both shows will not appear on, the, on Nickelodeon itself. This is actually very, actually, very, very a good idea. Why? Because people have Netflix, and in my opinion, the kid was dying, unfortunately. The best option is to do on Netflix. Well, yeah, that, that sucked that both the show will not be made to come out on Nickelodeon itself. I don't know, though, this is a very small idea. Now, now, without a said though, how do I think these both shows will perform Netflix? I don't know. We'll got to wait to see that until we get one with me. But I'm just excited about these two, two reboots. Well, two, two TV more besides because one, they're animated. Two, they're from the collated and not from, not from corporate bullshit. Three, most of all, it makes sense to me on Netflix. But they're two specials, and if the and if the, if the fan, if the fan if they support these two shows and then well specials, maybe we can finally get another series again. Nah, do I expect to see any series to come come out of this? Hmm, I have no idea. What what could what could my life want to show that they didn't need a consideration? It had an ending. Well, kind of. I think I had any. I don't remember. The biggest thing that needed consideration because I saw any of Magic Clipping her. But I am happy, sorry that Bobby's shirt are coming back. At least on Netflix. <laughs> now, with all that said, though, how did these shirts are going to perform? Like I said previously, I don't know. But uh, when it when it go premiere, we don't know. So, in terms of more information on when the shirts are going to premiere, I'm just going to hope about a for worse. And since Bobby Shaw is not going to bring out there on Nickelodeon, it's going to appear on Netflix. I, I'm going to wait for a trailer until that comes out, until we come up in the actual release date. But until then, what is with the ads? Anyway, um, do my part and be a Zim and welcome to Modern Night Special Hands on Netflix. Um, put your comment on the monitor. You think about the ancient news? Do you like it? Do it. Also, how do you feel about Invader Zim and welcome to Modern Night Special Hands on Netflix staying more on TV?
we don't comment, comment below. Also, on my Twitter page, on Twitter, we don't just comment channel, on Twitch, my stuff. Please do bye, guys. You can add more shit on trip. Let me preview you as you can. And I'll talk about it. Long and better than I can run right. See ya. Bye. I'm gonna do the game channel. Ding, 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 ding. You can go. Anyways, see ya. Bye. Walk out and sit and better than. See ya.